What is up, guys? It's Evan. And Lords. For Tales Channel, bringing you the latest in Sonic the Hedgehog news and updates. So, the Sonic South by Southwest panel has finished, and there are a lot of announcements to share with you, so stick around. The first major announcement is that Sonic Mania Plus is coming this summer. For starts, we are introducing two new playable characters. Mighty the Armadillo. <laughs> All right. Ray the Flying Squirrel. Good. Mania Plus is an expansion of Sonic Mania, adding a playable Mighty the Armadillo and Ray the Flying Squirrel, a new feature named Encore Mode, a four-player competition mode, and much more. If you already bought the game digitally, you will be able to get Mania Plus with a paid DLC update. We know that the DLC will have a discount, so don't worry, you won't have to pay full price for it. All the platforms that Sonic Mania has released on, including Nintendo Switch and Steam, will be getting Mania Plus. The love for Mania did not end there, however. A new animated series of Sonic Mania shorts called Sonic Mania Adventures will premiere on the Sonic YouTube channel this April. Currently, five shorts are planned. They are being animated by Tyson Hess and the music is being composed by T. Lopes. A sneak preview was shown at the panel which indicated that this animated series seems to show what happens to classic Sonic following the events of Sonic Forces. IDW got some attention at the panel, but there really wasn't a whole lot shown off. If we get any new information in regards to Sonic comics, it will be at the second Sonic IDW Town Hall next week. So, stay tuned for that. A series of small announcements followed. A collaboration between Sega and sportswear manufacturer Puma was announced, where the RS0 Sonic sneakers were unveiled. These shoes will be available starting in June, but they will only be in stock for a limited time and in limited numbers. Additionally, Hardlight Sonic Forces Speed Battle is going to receive a brand new environment, Mystic Jungle. The panel also announced that the mobile game was downloaded 12 million times. The biggest announcement came at the end of the panel following the Q&A segment. A brand new Sonic racing game was teased. We will throw in one more note to say it's not a sequel to any previous game that we've released. So that's the other tidbit we'll give you there. The announcement may not surprise you though. Rumors have been circulating about it for a while. Either way, we'll probably hear more about this game in the near future. And if you're feeling bored at the end of your week, we do a live stream every Saturday, 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, so come hang out with myself and Lords, playing hey. some Sonic games and stuff. And that's all for now. This was Lords. And Evan for Tales Channel. If you were informed, be sure to leave a like, a comment, and subscribe for more Sonic the Hedgehog news and updates. See you all next time, and have a fantastic, fantastic rest, rest of, of your, your week. week. I, I love stuff. I want to die. <laughs>